I, I was so fascinated. I remember where I was when someone told me about pheromones, that there's these chemicals that like leave our bodies and then into my chemicals will interfere with your chemicals. I just thought that was absolute witchcraft. And I'm a very like logical science based person. So I need science and evidence to believe anything. And then when I heard this rumor that like, you know, if you put a, a my mother and my sister in the same house, their menstrual cycles would sync up. That's right. I Googled it to check if it was true. Google told me it was true. And then I thought, fuck, I now believe in witchcraft. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Like if, well, have if you read the book, possible, The Red Tent? I no, mean, I it's haven't. like very much along those lines of like biblical times, they had a red red tent for women, menstruating women. And then it would just like the whole tribe would like sync up and they'd be in the red tent during menstruating times. They've done studies with um, t-shirts and attractiveness. So you will smell a t-shirt that, you know, they've done studies with women and men have worn the t-shirts and then you smell the t-shirt and you say like, I like the scent or I don't. And it's not body odor, it's pheromones. And um, they've matched it with like the pheromones that you like. And then you see the visual and there's a match. Like this person is attractive and then you smell the pheromone and there's like a match. It's that person's pheromones.